So I just bought this Gen 1 project car. Uh, it's a Jep import, as you can see from the Mitsubishi Motor Company badge there. Now, the grill, being a Jap import grill, is actually quite a cool grill. It's hard to see on this camera. Um, it's in very poor condition. This car's been stood around, as are the headlight surrounds. So in this video, I'm just going to uh, renovate this grill and uh, try and spruce it up a little bit. All right, so now I've got it off and we have a look close. Um, it looks like at one stage this was actually chrome and someone's just gone over it with an aerosol pretty badly. Uh, I'm going to give that a rub back and see how that comes up. If it comes up good, I'll probably leave it chrome. Uh, if it comes up pretty rubbish, I'll probably do the same and, and go over it black, but do a bit better job than obviously the last person did. So after rubbing this down, I think the reason it has been painted is because the chrome is very, very pitted. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to paint that again the same way the previous owner did. All right, so I've taken this out of the grill. Um, it was held in with some little metal clips on the on the plastic bits there. Now, 30 something years of wear and tear have taken their toll. So I'm probably gonna have to bond that back in when I'm finished. Um, but now that's out, I think I'll paint these two bits separately. Still deciding on what to do with colors, uh, but we'll see how we go. I've finished painting the grill. Um, I use this Septone Satin Black. It's actually very good if you're not good at painting. The finish is very forgiving. Uh, I don't know if you can see on the camera here, but it's come out quite nice. And then for the top section, I've gone for a nice glossy red. Um, still unsure whether to leave that red, do it black, do it white, whatever. Um, but yeah, should look good when it's all back together. And once I've done that, I've got the headlamp surrounds to do as well. All right, so I've just put the headlight surrounds back in. I uh, just like the grill, they came up really well. On the Gen 1, you need to take the indicators out in order to get the headlight surrounds out. And the lenses were absolutely filthy on the inside. So I've taken them inside and give them a good wash uh, with like a bottle brush. And they've actually come up like brand new. So if your lenses are looking a bit average, just take them off and clean all the crap from the inside. So when all this goes back together, it should all look pretty all good. Right, so here's the finished product. Uh, with that red strip, I ended up using some 1200 grit wet and dry. And I actually sanded the MMC back to the plastic. Uh, I was going to put some lacquer over the top to make it shiny but I think I'll just leave it with like the dull matte finish. Um, just got to put it back on the car now and see how it looks. <laughs> 